Good day, folks. Today, I've got a couple interesting products I want to show you. They are accessories for your Osmo action. So let's just jump right in and take a closer look. So I've featured a few uh, products by Ulanzi on my channel over the last couple weeks. They make some really interesting accessories for many different products, GoPros, the Osmo Pocket, the Osmo Action. So here in front of me, I've got a vlogging case and a power stick, and uh, we're going to take a look at them and see how they work. So let's just open up the box here and we'll see what all comes in the package when you get it, and then we'll check it out. So as you can see here, here is the vlogging case. We also get a finger mount that we can attach to the bottom depending on how we're going to mount it. And then of course we get some screws and an Allen wrench to connect the finger mount. So on the bottom of the vlogging case you can see we have a quarter 20 and uh, we can connect this directly to a tripod or any other kind of handle or pole that has a quarter 20 mount on it. However, for most people that are going to want the finger mount on there, and that way it's compatible with GoPro mounts and accessories. So as you can see there, I've now got it attached and now we can attach it to different handles and poles and uh, any other kind of accessory that has a finger mount on it. Now, a couple interesting things about this vlogging case, you can see there we have a cold shoe at the top, but we also have a second one at the side. And that's really handy for those who are going to be wanting to add multiple accessories such as a microphone and a light. You can also see there we have two other quarter 20s if you need that kind of mount there as well. So to insert our Osmo Action, we just push up the back plate. It's a nice snug fit, which is good. You don't want any kind of vibrations or it rattling around. Once your Osmo Action's in there, we just put the back plate back in and it snaps in. Now a casing like this is not just for vlogging or adding attachments. Many people buy these just because they're made of a very durable aluminum and that gives a lot of protection for your Osmo Action. Depending on how you're using your camera, sometimes they can take some abuse Having it in an aluminum frame like this does give it a lot of protection. Even if dropped directly on concrete, you may still chance damaging this lens, but it is easily removable and replaceable. When it's installed, you have full access to your charging port and your memory card slot, and all the buttons needed to operate the camera are fully accessible. So we've talked about protecting your Osmo Action if you've dropped it or it takes a hard knock, but these cases really shine when you want to set up a vlogging rig. For example, we have the cold shoe at the top. We can attach a microphone just into the cold shoe like that. And like I stated earlier, Earlier, it does have that second cold shoe so if you want to add something additional like a light you can easily do so this is the Litra Torchlight version 1 they actually have a version 2 out now an updated version but as you can see you can add a light very easy to your vlogging setup then it's just a matter of adding some type of handle and you're good to go the other thing I want to show you here is this battery grip now I have featured different battery grips on my channel over the years there was one by um, Fayutech that I really like unfortunately it is just no longer in stock um, it's hard to come by in certain countries uh, I think they're just not manufacturing it anymore but Ulanzi does make one here this one here has a 5200 milliamp battery and essentially this is just a power bank so you could use it just like this to charge up any device you can charge up your smartphone GoPros Osmo Action if you remove this cover here you can see we have a micro USB port and a regular sized USB A port at the top here it has a quarter 20 for for attaching to different devices. At the bottom here, it has another Core 20, so you could actually put this on an extension pole or on a tripod. Because this handle has a quarter 20 thread at the top, to attach it to this vlogging setup that we just went over, we'd have to remove the finger mounts and that would reveal the quarter 20 at the bottom of the case and then we could just screw this in. But for me, a better solution because when I'm using these kind of devices, I'm always usually connecting it to some kind of GoPro mount that kind of seems to be the standard. Just put one of those tripod adapters on it and then you can easily mount it to all your different hardware. So now we have a nice 5200 milliamp power bank attached as a handle and uh, it gives you that nice extra reach if you need it if you're vlogging but what really comes in handy is it now can act as a power bank to top off our Osmo Action or even our light if we start getting low in power. This power bank handle comes with two different cables. It has a USB-A to USB-C and it has a USB-A to micro USB. USB-A to micro USB can be used for a couple different reasons. Uh, first of all, it's used to recharge the battery grip. To recharge the battery grip, you would just plug it into the bottom port there and then into a wall charger. But you can also use this cable to recharge the light because it's a micro USB connector inside there so we just plug the USB-A in there so you can see I've got it plugged into the light there and uh, it might be kind of hard and faint to see but there's a light on this uh, light here and it's flashing that means it's now being charged but more importantly you can plug in the USB-C cable that comes with it and plug it into your Osmo Action and you can see there the Osmo Action is now being charged 
and that allows you to do a lot of filming throughout a day without having to worry about changing your batteries. So yeah, some nice equipment from Ulanzi. I'll leave the links down below to these uh, products where you can go check them out further. Now there is one issue, and at the time of filming this video, if you're watching this maybe six months down the road, uh, that might not be an issue anymore. And that is that DJI has not released any kind of adapter to connect a microphone to the Osmo Action as of yet. I'm sure one is in the works and we probably will be seeing one in the very near future. Uh, so just keep that in mind. Well, folks, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And we'll see you in the next one.